In this video, we'll show how we can get the formula for the area of a circle. First, we need to know what is the perimeter of a circle, also called the circumference. So, the circumference is the length of this line, and it is equal to 2 pi times the radius. In fact, pi is by definition equal to the ratio of the circumference to the diameter of a circle, so pi is by definition equal to c over 2r, which means that the circumference is equal to pi times 2r or 2 pi r. To get the area of a circle, we'll divide the circle into an even number of congruent parts, and then we'll rearrange them in the following way. We start with one part, then put the second part next to it, rotated by 180 degrees, then the third, the fourth, and we keep doing this until we use all the parts. This segment is the radius of the circle. And this curved line consists of half of all circle arcs. The other half is over here. So the length of this curved line is equal to circumference over 2. We divided the circle into 8 parts. The more parts we divide it into, the more this figure resembles a rectangle. Here are a few examples of what it looks like. The area of the circle is equal to the area of this rectangle. This side of the rectangle is equal to the radius of the circle, well, this side is one half of the circumference. So the area of the circle is equal to c over 2 times r. And here's why we needed to know what is the circumference of the circle. So the area is equal to 2 pi r over 2 times r, which is equal to pi r squared. Now we'll show an example where we'll use this formula. Suppose that the perimeter of a square is equal to the circumference of a circle. Which one has greater area, the square or the circle? Well, since a is the side of the square, then the perimeter of the square is equal to 4 times a, and since r is the radius of the circle, then the circumference of the circle is equal to 2 pi r which means that the radius of the circle is equal to 4 times a over 2 pi. And that is equal to 2a over pi. Now, the area of the square is equal to a squared, and the area of the circle is equal to pi r squared but r is equal to 2a over pi, so this is equal to pi times 2a over pi squared, which is equal to pi times 4a squared over pi squared, and that is equal to 4a squared over pi. And since pi is less than 4, then this is greater than a squared. So, the area of the circle is greater than the area of the square. With that in mind, I leave you with this problem. The area of one circle is five times greater than the area of another circle. What is the ratio of their radii? That is all for this video. If you liked it, click the like button, it helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you next time.